Good day ladies and gents, hope everybody's doing well. I want to cover a couple of things today, but let's start... Let me turn the sound off. Let's start with the last minute news. Uh, yep, all the bosses have been buffed to 18% spawn rate. Kilogluhar 5.56% on streets, Guns 15, 18, depending on the map, and no changes to Kalta. So Kalta still spawned with what, like 7? 7% chance, I guess? Anyway, yeah, I was uh, looking for Rishala yesterday, I'm level 52 in the game, and I still need to kill Rishala for the quest. And I think I played for the whole day before the buff, and I haven't, Rishala, I haven't found Rishala once. And after the buff, I've played for around 3, maybe 4 hours, and I managed to find Rishala twice, but both of the times he was already dead. Every single time I was late by like 30-40 seconds, like I was literally getting close to the arms and I would hear somebody else kill Rishala. So yeah, I still, I still have to kill him. Anyway, to the main news. Um, I, I want to talk about the fact that BSG is trying to release a lot of updates and they are talking about the patch notes in advance. Like for example, the original time when they talked about patch notes, fixing um, binaural audio, footsteps, headset settings, uh, DLSS update, new player group system, all of that stuff. It came out on 19th of January, right? And they never said they're gonna do this in one patch and they never said when. And it took them a week to release the first patch, which came out on the 27th, I believe. So they've done, they've done some recall changes, and there we go. Patch is out, 27. So it took them a week after the first time they posted the, the notes. They tried to fix the sound. It didn't really help much. They tried to fix the memory leak issues. Not sure if it helped much. I am playing with Banoral off, because it still decreases the frames. Anyway, they tried, and I guess something, something got fixed. Then they installed the hotfix for the visual bug and uh, volume, good, working fast and efficient. And then later on they posted, there we go, they posted the estimated plan of the changes. Which doesn't really make sense to me because they posted exactly the same thing like what, three weeks ago? And they're just reposting it without any dates. However, I do believe uh, they, will, they will manage to deliver. I think right now there is two main problems in the game. First one is uh, sound. Oculus, Oculus Audio, you can't tell where the players are, and also the memory leak, which is uh, related to Oculus Audio, you're playing in the game, you've got the memory leak, you get less frames, or your game crashes. And the second problem for me personally is cheaters, I really believe something has to be done with cheaters, there's been too many of them recently. And there's been a couple of small bugs here and there, for example, I was getting a really funny and annoying bug yesterday, I had a SKS which I wanted to sell, and I couldn't sell it. I couldn't. I couldn't uh, disassemble it. Every single time I was taking mods out, I would get a 228 error that would kick me to the main screen. Then I click on my character, and it's like nothing happened. I tried selling SKS, couldn't sell it. I tried deleting SKS, that didn't work. As soon as I would do something, it would roll it back. And five minutes after I was messing around with SKS, I finally managed to delete it. I was like, all right, bro, maybe I should take it into the raid and just drop it in the raid. Maybe that was the only option. And the second thing, which is really well, kind of pissing me off, is the bug of aborted the game. Like, you look for the game, right? You find the game after two minutes, three minutes of searching, it starts loading you in, and then it says game aborted. And you have to disconnect from the game, you keep all of your loot, you keep all of your items, and then you need to restart the game and search again. That's the only way for effects. And I was getting that stuff sometimes two times a day, sometimes three times a day. And that's another bug which is pissing me off. Uh, but yeah, to the original point of the video, do I think BG will be able to fulfill their promises of fixing everything? I do believe so. I honestly think it's gonna be done within the next month, month and a half, so before uh, April. Before April, we're gonna get all of the promised stuff. I am pretty sure that invisible players will be fixed within a month or so, like, fully fixed. The sound should be better. Um, not sure about the new version of DLSS, because I'm not playing with DLSS, not really interested too much in that. Uh, but yeah, I've got, my ho I've got my hopes high, and so should you. It's not a bad thing to... Uh, look down. We need to support BSG, and I feel, I feel like I feel like most of the time I've been criticizing BSG. So yeah, in this video I'm gonna I'm gonna stand with them and wish them all the best, and I truly do believe in them. So yep, yeah, thanks so much for coming in. I think we're more or less done with this video. Let me know in the comments what you think. What's your opinion on this whole situation? And I'll see you in the next one.